The Metropolitan Museum of Art in New York has returned a gilded coffin looted by art thieves in the wake of the Arab Spring to the Egyptian authorities. The sarcophagus dates back to the 1st century BC and once held the mummy of Nejamank, a priest of the Ram god Herishaf. The highly ornamented coffin was unwittingly purchased by the museum for $4 million in 2017 and was the centerpiece of the Nejamak and his Gilded Coffin exhibition that opened the following year. But in February, the coffin was seized by New York units investigating the trafficking of antiquities. During the ceremony to return the coffin, Cyrus Vance, Manhattan's district attorney, said the investigation has revealed that the coffin is just one of hundreds of antiquities stolen by the same multinational trafficking ring. We are uh, welcoming with gratitude and uh, with real thanks the Egyptian Minister of Foreign Affairs, uh, Sameh Shukri, and Homeland Security Special Agent in Charge, Peter Fitzhugh, to rep repatriate an extraordinary artifact to its country of origin. The gold coffin, which I hope uh, you will have a chance to see, uh, is of Nejamunk, and it dates back to somewhere between 150 and 50 BC, where it was made of cartonnage, which is layers of plastered linen and papyrus, and fully gilded in Egypt. It's believed that this coffin once held the remains of Nejamunk, who was a high-ranking priest. Now, this coffin was actually buried in Egypt for more than 2,000 years until it was looted from Egypt in 2011. From there, in 2011, the coffin was illegally transported to a warehouse in Dubai and subsequently shipped to Germany for restoration and then went to France for sale. It finally arrived here in New York in 2017, where it was sold to the Metropolitan Museum of Art for approximately $4 million by a French dealer. Now, our office has been investigating this network for more than seven years. I want to uh, congratulate both countries uh, for uh, the success in uh, the relentless efforts uh, that has uh, resulted eventually in the repatriation of the coffin of the Egyptian priest uh, uh, Nedam Nedamank. And you pronounce it much better than I do to its homeland. This uh, success story is a fruitful result of the cooperation that has lasted over a year between the Egyptian authorities and the American authorities.